So um, I think I'm losing track of how many award watch lists you're on right now. Uh, what does that mean to you? Uh, you know, it means a lot. Uh, you know, obviously it reflects on you know the type of season that we had as a team last year, and um, you know all those guys that you know were there last year with us. You know, allowed me to have a great year. And, um, you know, hopefully we can just build on that this year and uh, um, you know have another great season. Last year you kind of went to more up tempo offense. So this year, will we see it? You know, get a little bit quicker. Yeah, I, yeah, that's a, that's a, that's the thing this year is to you know get it going as fast as we can. Um, you know, hopefully we can you know build on what we did last year and um, you know get our get our line in and out, get our receivers in and out. You know, get everybody going and uh, you know up tempo and um, you know anytime you can do that, you know you can keep the defense on their heels and. Um, you know, all that to have them always second guessing and everything, and you know that's what that's what we uh, kind of base our offense about with the tempo is you know trying to keep the defense on the pills, and you know hopefully we'll continue to do that this year. At the wide receiver spot, you lost a lot of experience. You have you have guys back, but guys that haven't caught a lot of balls at this point in their career. Can you talk about that process and how that's working out? Well, obviously, you know you can't replace uh, a Riley or, or a, a Levon. You know those guys are so great. And, um, they did so much for us last year, but you know we had a lot of guys behind them that you know watched them play and you know were under them and uh, learned a lot from them. And, um, you know, got out this spring, this summer, and you know really uh, made some progress in, in that area. And um, you know, so far this first week has been really good. And, you know, we we're, we're starting to find out who's going to be our main guys, our main targets, and guys that we can uh, look to to make good plays. And, um, you know, I think we have a lot of depth there too, just like last year. And uh, you know. Um, that's, that's always good to see as a quarterback and something that you want. And, um, you know, we have a lot of guys that I know I can, uh, you know, trust and, um, you know, have faith in this year. And uh, it's going to be fun to see them, you know, grow up and, and uh, you know, make plays. Week into camp, but have any of the true freshmen caught your eye? Uh, yeah, there's there's a bunch. You know, the Daz Patterson, you know, he was here this spring with us. And, um, you know, ever since he's been here, you know, he's, he's done a lot better, wanting to get better every single day. And, um, you know, he's out there. Uh, Say Sebastian Smith, uh, Jordan Reed, those two at the receiver position have, have really stuck out. And, um, you know that's what you like to see. You, know, you like to see those young guys, you know, catching your eye and going out there making plays and being consistent and learning the offense. And um, you know that's what we need. And uh, you know hopefully they can step in and um, you, you know make some plays this year and uh, get used to everything and be a part of what we have going on here. You do have a lot of expectations coming into this season. Does that worry you or concern you at all, um, living up to that that hype? No, no, no. I I don't think so. You know, we we uh, this is what we came here for is to have that target on our back and you know to be picked to to win the MAC and the MAC East and everything. And um, you know that's what we strive for this whole off season is you know to be the best. And but uh, you know obviously we have to go out and you know prove that and get to back to Detroit and, and win that thing. And that's that's our biggest thing this year is that we have some unfinished business. And, that we, we want to get back to Detroit and take care of that. About any individual goals for the season? Uh, you know, individual stuff. I don't I don't really you know focus. I'm more of a team oriented guy, and um, you know just just wanting to focus you know more on our team goals if anything. And, you know, I've always said you know all that stuff individual play will take care of it at the end of the year. Uh, but um, you know if there's one thing, just get better each, every, every day. You know, and uh, just try and be a better player. And, um, but I'm, I'm more focused on our team and what we want to do as a team and our goals and everything. And I'm really excited for what we have this year. When you talk about team goals, in your mind, what will it take to have a successful season? Uh, you know, obviously, uh, you know, have a good good uh, record in non-conference play and then get into conference. And, you know, just every single week matters, you know, in the MAC. And um, we just got to take it one game at a time in the MAC. And, um, you know, hopefully if we do that, we'll get back to Detroit and win that game and, um, you know, get to a, to a bowl game. And, um, you know, with the, with the team that we have this year, we have we have a really chance to do something special, and you know, hopefully, maybe break into the top 25.